What's up guys and welcome to New Tarot. I am an energy and intuitive reader and I'm here to do the what's the issue need a tissue for somebody. So let's see. Aquarius. What's up Aqua? Thank you so much for being here. This message could resonate with you if you have Aquarius as a sun, moon, rising, or Venus. All right, Aquarius. So this is a new smack. This is a new segment I'm doing called What's the Issue? Do you need a tissue? All right, so we're going to see what the issue is that's going on in your life. We're going to ask the universe for some advice. And then we're going to see what is the cause of this issue and what could possibly happen if you solve it. The one that needs a tissue, okay? <laughs> All right, Aquarius. What's the issue here? What's going on, Aquarius? You have the four of wands, the bottom of the deck, okay? You have the queen of pentacles in reverse, the devil in reverse, and the two of cups in reverse. There, you're having a difficult time releasing um, someone who you separated from or who you are not doing so. The connection is just not doing so well. Um, woo, chap. Boo-boo. Okay. Um... I'm, I mean, with the Two of Cups here, this could be romance, but I, it doesn't really have to be either. Could be a mother figure. I'm getting with the Queen of Pentacles. It could be someone in your family as well, or a Capricorn. But whoever this is, you and this person are not together, or the relationship between you and them is just like separating, or you feel like you're being pulled apart, and that's on purpose, because the universe wants you to stop giving time and energy into this. But I feel like they keep reeling you back in in some way with the Devil in Reverse. They keep reeling you back in. But with the Four of Wands, the Six of Wands, and the Death card at the bottom of the deck, Aquarius, you are going to be successful by dropping this, ending this for right now. Um, you have to go, this, you and this person have to go through a transformation separately. That's why you're being pulled apart because you guys both still have some transformations and stuff that has to go, that has to happen individually. This could be with the Scorpio. Okay, um, but it's like something keeps pulling me back, me back. I need you in my life. I'm gonna try to go. Yeah, it's like something keeps pulling you back to this person or to this, you know, whatever this is. And the universe is like, no. It could be a new beginning that that is is wanting to come about, and it's not gonna it's not gonna happen because. Um, you know, I don't, you know, you have to stop nurturing this. For a lot of you, you, you know what this is because you feel like you're being, you're being drifted apart, you're being pulled apart from this person, but that's on purpose. All right. What is the advice here? You have the hanging man in reverse. You have the king of cups in reverse, the two of wands, the page of cups in reverse. Literally stop caring. Stop like king of cups in reverse is, is just stop giving emotion to it. Stop it. The two of wands, they want you to start making plans to get away from this. All right. With the page of cups in reverse, you're not listening to your intuition. The hanging man in reverse, I feel like you're kind of stuck. Okay. So, I mean, they they want a really hard cut off, like cut off all the emotions, like block, control, alt, delete type of energy. But this King of Cups in reverse, they want you to not even like just completely go cold on this person. Like, because I feel like that's the only way because they keep pulling you back. Like, I feel like you, you could be trying to be nice about this, but there is no there is no being nice about it. I don't I don't feel like there is. I feel like there is it it's just it is what it is. I feel like the energy has been cold on you. I feel like this energy started turning cold on you and I feel like it it could have been like like from one day to another. And um it's like it's like it was all lovey dovey and great and then you know this person was you know being emotionally supportive, being emotionally there and then they just went cold out of nowhere. I feel like this person is slowly um doing this to protect themselves because they are probably wanting to separate from you too or they're indecisive on what to do with something in their life when it comes to you too it's like 
it's like oddly both of you guys are kind of going through the same thing but it's like the other energy kind of started it first i don't know aquarius bottom of the deck is the sixth chakra your intuition is screaming at you to do this all right you have strategy i i, I get it. it's not going to be easy to remove yourself from this person but they want you to come up with a plan they want you to sit down and actually really start thinking about it okay you have the temple path here because you it's like you're um there's something here that's waiting for you with this temple path you have to go through something and you have to step this energy can't come with you and whatever is in whatever is in this temple path or like past this gazebo, you know, metaphorically speaking, um, it's like it's transform is transformative. And this could be blocking you from that. OK, and then you have caring connections. I mean, this could be it's like you have to this could be you separating yourself from a certain energy in order for you to be able to connect with someone who you love with someone who you care about. OK, again, it could be a mother figure. With the Queen of Pentacles in reverse, with the Two of Cups in reverse, could be a sibling or someone that you, you know, it could be a close friend too. I'm not really getting lovey-dovey vibes, but it could be a marriage. If you're married to someone, it could absolutely be a marriage, a marriage, and that you know that it's like, um, it's it's lost its flavor, then you know that it's that, right? Everybody's is different. I'm seeing like seven different messages here, so you will know which one is for you. All right, Aquarius, that's all that I have for you. I hope this helped. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this and stay positive.